guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Truthi and my blog is called Balencia that you can follow on my Instagram handle. My today's video is a hairdo with Balencia and the hair mask that we are making today is for people who have dry and damaged hair. Now there are a lot of environmental factors, a lot of chemical factors, blow drying, doing things to your hair, coloring, all of that really damages your hair, makes them really dry and lifeless. And because of that, we have to give it some nutrition, we have to give it some kind of, you know, boost to make it look really nice and make it look silky smooth and take all that dryness away so my today's mask is going to be focusing on people who have dry and damaged hair and it's a very 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 powerful mask that we're going to be making today with lots of ingredients involved so if you are someone who's interested in knowing this please do continue watching this video if you are watching this video please do subscribe to my channel and now without any further ado let's get into the video So one by one, let me take you through all the ingredients that we have for this big Maha mask that we are making today for our dry hair. Now I have already oiled my hair, that's why I'm not using any form of oil in the mask. But if you all need to use oil, you can always use almond oil or castor oil in the uh, mask itself to make it, give it a little bit of more hydration. But I already have oil in my hair, so I'm not going to be adding any oil to the mask. Now to begin with, we have... A very unique ingredient that I'm using today for the first time on my hair, this mayonnaise. Now, I never thought that mayonnaise could actually be used for hair, but apparently it does and it has very, very, very good hydrating properties to, you know, make your hair look really nice and silky. The second thing that we have here is yogurt. Now, yogurt, of course, we know is amazing for dry hair always. It's really, really going to smoothen out your hair and really going to give you that nice and silky look. Then we have here is egg. Now, you all may not be able to see my egg uh, as well, but here if for a look. Uh, but yes, we have egg over here and this is going to give our hair all the protein that it requires to, you know, kind of uh, give it that nice strength, give it that nice bond and really make our hair really, really nice and strong. So these are our ingredients. And for the fourth ingredient that we have today is vitamin E. Pill. Now you all can also substitute this with aloe vera but vitamin E again is very good to just cleanse out your entire scalp and it really really you know kind of provides it that really uh, clean uh, look for your uh, hair and it just acts as an agent to basically cleanse everything from your scalp. So you are going to be mixing all of this together and making this entire big mask. So in this bowl of egg that I have, I'm going to be first putting in the mayonnaise. I've taken two spoons of mayonnaise in for this. Empty it out completely in this. Then I have taken two spoons of yogurt as well, which I am going to empty out in the bowl. And then comes time for our vitamin E pill. So we have that here. I'm just going to break that a little bit with a scissor and pour it right into my bowl and this is a huge bowl that I have got over here with some amazing ingredients and now we just mix it all together and make a really nice mask you can see like my bowl is come up till yours it's that big so this is a closer look at what my bowl looks like while i am mixing it it's this really thick 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 mask that we have made over here so just keep mixing it really well till everything gets mixed up together and forms into a nice mask a nice paste over here so now that I have this mask completely mixed with itself, now I'm going to start applying this on my head and I'm going to of course start with my roots. So I'm going to go nicely into my scalp and once I am done going into my whole scalp, massaging it really nicely and properly into all the areas of my scalp, I will then run it down my hair and go into my tips. So this is a very big mask of course it is going to be remaining you can definitely use it for your entire hair rather than just for your scalp 
so definitely take a generous amount and put it like literally all over not only your scalp but also at the bottoms of your hair also at the tips of your hair because those are extremely important to kind of you know take care of it's not only of course scalp is the most important because that's where the growth happens but even this is very very important once you have the entire mask on your hair, just kind of secure it nicely in a bun, in a ponytail, in a plait, however you would like it. But just keep it nice and firm so that it Im totally gets immersed into your hair and really gives it all that nutrition. So this was the mask that you all should really make for your dry and damaged hair. Keep this on for a good 30 minutes to an hour and then wash it with a nice mild uh, shampoo and conditioner. And you will see the results. You will see that your hair is looking less drier, less rough, less, less you know, no kind of frizzy it is really nice and smoothened out and also do this at least two times a week to get the best results because of course not only in one time you're going to see the results it's going to take you two three times to start seeing the results properly so definitely do this and if you all have any further questions on this please leave in our comments and i'll be happy to answer them for you if you are still watching this video please subscribe to my channel like this video and share this video and i'll be back with another very very, very soon till then bye bye